Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. On this video, it's not really a get unready with me more of a than it is a skincare after work day routine. So I'm basically just going to show you how I take care of my skin after a long day at work. So if you're interested, keep watching. So every time I take off my shirt, obviously, and my jewelry, and I start with the with makeup wipes i always use equate brand i've never to seen a reason why spend more money for getting the same effect so <laughs> i go ahead and grab the equate wipes and start to remove my makeup and this is a day where i swear i wore minimal makeup i only wore a little concealer and powder and blush and you still have a lot of makeup on so no matter what even when you think it's just a little it's always a lot. So next I use my Clinique Take the Day Off. It's a, um, basically for mascara and eyeliner. For all makeup, but that's what I use it for, my mascara, because it's really hard to get off. So I just put it on a cotton round and rub it against my eyelashes basically. And a good tip to use this for is to clean mascara or eyeliner if it gets on your contact lenses. I swear by it, I don't use a lot, enough to get the product off my lenses. It works every time. So yeah, I just continue to wipe it off and sing my meat songs that I'm playing in the background that you can't hear yeah just get that makeup off and then I just jump right in with this purity face soap I got that as a gift and I'm basically using it until it's done but I won't be using that product again it's just really drying to my skin and I have that little face scrubber I'm gonna show you what that came with in a little while but the little face scrubber, I put the soap on there. And I it's gentle, but it does scrape, you know, scrub your skin to get whatever excess makeup is on your face off. I like this little thing. So that's my face after the first cleaning, but I do go in with a gentle exfoliant, that L'Oreal Go 360 Clean, Ideal Clean, and that's where the little scrubber thing came from. It came in there. This is a, <clears throat> excuse me guys, this is a gentle exfoliant for your skin. It's not harsh at all, which is why I use it every day that I wear makeup. It doesn't dry me out any more than any other product does. And afterwards, I definitely feel as if my face is clean, clean. So I'm just rubbing this into my skin. And there's this um, saying, it's basically saying that you should wash your face with your hands for one full minute per day, um, if not more, but at least one full minute. So what you saw is me setting my timer, and I still have that L'Oreal exfoliant on. And I just basically go in with my hands and rub the soap across my skin, trying to get it even more clean for a full minute. So this is by Freeman. It's a purifying clay mask, avocado and oatmeal. That paddle did not come with it. I tried to use the paddle at first to spread it, but it didn't work out well. I usually use my hands, but um, 
you'll see in a minute I go back to using my hands because the paddle just wasn't cutting it but after using this product it definitely makes you know my skin feel smoother softer and a little better as far as being hydrated but it's not great like you at the end of the day whatever cleaner you use you're gonna have to just use a good moisturizer at the end and I will you'll see so I basically just spread this around try and keep it in an even layer on my face and once this dries basically it says 15 minutes but once it's dry basically you can rinse it off so in a moment you'll see me setting my alarm to start the 15 minutes and then I'm moving on with my end of day routine basically so that's it basically I grab my water bottle because I wear wigs I always moisturize at night so my hair can be free while I'm cooking dinner or whatever and able to absorb whatever I put in it so I always start with of course water I rub that into my hair really well <sighs> I think I was washing my hands here and then I go in with my little homemade apple cider vinegar and water I have a video coming I'm still like I don't know what to call it in in the process of like growing your e edges back and believe it or not I know mine still look thin but I promise you they are way better than they were like in my little routine that I do it definitely works so guys be on the lookout for that like I have footage for it and all oh and then of course that's ap um, olive oil extra virgin olive oil and I just put that into my hair I always wonder if there's a certain type you should buy but extra virgin is extra virgin right so I just use that one and distribute it all through my hair look at my curls they trying <laughs> So then I use the Shea Moisture Strengthen and Restore Edge Treatment and I put that on my edges and I massage that in really well at, le at least five minutes. I'm going to speed it up. Well, no, I'll cut it out, but yeah, five minutes I massage that into my scalp and I'm just showing you the consistency of that. It's like a jelly. So then I go back in with a little bit more water. Water is always the key with natural hair. And I use the Cantu Moisturizing Curl Cream Activator as a moisturizer in my hair. So I rub that between my fingers and then try and distribute it as evenly as possible throughout my hair. So since I'm done rubbing that in, I go in and I touch the mask to see if it's dry. Once it's dry, you can go ahead and rinse that off of your face, which is what I go ahead and do and dry my skin off. And that is my little magic potion of ACV, apple cider vinegar and water again. And I just put that on a cotton round and I use it as a toner for my face. If you do your research, you'll see there's many uses for apple cider vinegar. And I almost use it for every single use there is as far as skin care and hair care. Like I wash my hair in it. I treat my edges with it. I tone my skin with it to say the least. But I do, you know, it's good for you. So why not use it? And it's affordable. That is a cucumber gel face mask that I have. Um, I bought it in a set of three from Walmart. And after my skin dries from the ACV and I put on one of this trio of masks, at least one of them, afterwards my skin is amazing. It kind of puts back all the moisture that the cleansing products and even the ACV has stripped out. So I use the paddle for that and distribute that e evenly onto my skin. So once I get the mask completely on, I set my timer for 15 minutes and I wait. I'll be back. I'll be back. So coming up on the end of my timer, as you see, it's absorbed into my skin, but I still rinse it and look, 
like my skin looks nowhere near as dry as it did after I, the toner set in. So right after that, the last thing I do is my lip scrub. And this is out of a five pack I got for Christmas. It's from Ulta. So I just use that. I wet my lips with some water and I go ahead and massage that into my lips to get all the dead skin off. It tastes like sugar. I guess you could eat it, but seeing as how it's taking dead skin off my lips, I don't really want to ingest that. So I rub it in well and then I just rinse my mouth off and dry it. Now I go in with my Burt's Bees Pomegranate Chapstick and I put that on my lips and I jump into moisturizing my face, which I use the Clinique, Clinique Moisture Surge 72 Hour Auto Replenishing Hydrating. It's a gel. So I put that on my skin and it brings it right back. Excuse me y'all, but I'm listening to music while I get unready. So I put that on my face like so and massage it really well into my skin. And straight from there, I use, here it comes in a minute, the Clinique, it's, it's a night cream, I'm sorry y'all, um, but it's a night cream and it's really thick, like I love it on my skin and on especially cold days when I'm out and say I don't wear makeup on, this is one of the steps that I do not skip this um, moisturizer. Um, I finish up with the Mario Badescu Rose Water. And that's pretty much it for this, guys. I take my contacts out, put my glasses on, always go make me some wine, and I start cooking my dinner. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Give me some thumbs up if you like videos like this, because I don't mind doing more. And please comment, subscribe as always. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye. Until next time, bye.